Hi, I am Dr. Neeraj, working as Senior Resident in the Department of Medicine of Loknak Hospital. This is a government hospital under Delhi government. I have done my MD medicine from Maulana Azad Medical College campus, one of the uh, best medical colleges of India. Being working in a government hospital uh, which provides free medical facility to all uh, all the patients of different uh, strata of the society it is a very busy day as a resident doctor in this hospital our time starts at 8 in the morning and uh, it uh, it goes on till late in the evening and uh, like we see not less than 100 patient each day with different ailments ranging from simple fever to life-threatening conditions like uh, malignancy in simple terms cancer and all the best part of working in government hospital is that you see a lot of a uh, whole spectrum of illnesses presenting to you patients of uh, various uh, diseases are uh, available to you in abundance and you have no dearth of patients but the disadvantage is that being in a government setup there is a very maddening rush of the patients uh, being uh, md medicine means i cater to all the patients who require attention of the uh, physician which means those conditions which which require treatment by drug and require no surgical intervention so uh, my patients include all those uh, who have minor ailments like fever and cough to life threatening uh, conditions like uh, cardiac disorders or some endocrine disorders like diabetes, hypertension or maybe uh, respiratory uh, complaints or uh, diseases like COPD, asthma and uh, various other ailments. So all those who, doing, uh, who uh, do MD medicine uh, usually either they stay as a general physician or they opt for a super specialty field like uh, cardiology, gastroenterology and endocrinology, neurology where they focus on just one system of the body. Now endocrinology and hepatology are upcoming branches which are basically hepatology is a further subdivision of gastroenterology where one concentrate only on uh, liver aspect of the body.